Hi, I want to talk to you for a few minutes about the nutritional benefits of eating broccoli. Now, I know that broccoli is not everyone's favorite vegetable, and for good reason. It does have a bitter taste, it can have a noxious odor when it's cooked, and a lot of us grew up eating overcooked, mushy broccoli that had no flavor. So that's what we think of when we think of eating broccoli. But our team is really excited to share with you some different ways of preparing broccoli that are delicious. And I want to motivate you to try those by telling you all about how healthy broccoli is for you. So broccoli is very high in antioxidants. It's full of lots of minerals and vitamins that we need for um, our health, including vitamin C, vitamin A, vitamin K, and calcium. It's a good source of fiber. It has nutrients in it that give it a bitter flavor, but those nutrients also have anti-cancer and anti-inflammatory properties. So in this case, bitter is better, and it's good if we can embrace that. The most nutritious broccoli is gonna be fresh broccoli. So if you can get your hands on a head of broccoli that has tightly closed buds that are dark green and a nice bright green firm stem, a cut end that has uh, that's moist and smooth then um, you're going to know that that broccoli is uh, as fresh as can be and as nutritious as can be you want to buy it whole store it whole uh, so that it doesn't deteriorate in nutritional quality in your refrigerator just put it in a plastic bag and try to eat it up within a few days now you can also buy broccoli frozen. It's not quite as nutritious as fresh broccoli, but it's very convenient and plenty nutritious. I always keep a few bags of broccoli in my freezer so that I can just grab a handful and add them to my favorite dishes. Now in terms of preparing broccoli, the most nutritious ways to prepare it are steaming, uh, microwaving, roasting, and sauteing in oil. The least nutritious way to prepare broccoli is by boiling it. And the reason for that is the nutrients that I talked about earlier are water soluble. So when you put broccoli into water and cook it that way, all of those good nutrients just spill out into the cooking water. And when you eat the broccoli itself, you don't get those health benefits. So I hope that you will be inspired by what I've said today to um, give broccoli a try, check out all of our ideas on how to prepare it and um, eat more broccoli. You'll be glad you did.